Catherine here. Just one other quick little clip. I'm probably not going to post this either, but I wanted to mention trains. <laughs> Every now and then, like, trains go through Hoosick Falls. Like, you know, they aren't passenger trains or, you know, like freight trains. And I mean, there's probably one that goes through like once a day. Um, maybe twice at the most. But anyway, today, like I heard a couple of trains like early in the day. And then I was out just now walking and I saw two separate trains go through. Like I've never witnessed that many trains go through Hoosick Falls in the whole three years I've lived here, you know, in one day. And um, I was lucky because I, I avoided both trains. Like I crossed the tracks and I looked back and I saw behind me a train was going through. And then when I was coming back from Tops, I saw the other train, but there's a way that you can take a couple side streets and avoid it. But the reason that I'm mentioning the trains is because I had a dream this morning about a train and I don't think I'm psychic. I really don't think I'm psychic, but, um, you know, I've long said that I feel like there's some way, some way, I don't know how that my enemies sometimes influence my dreams. Like I'll never understand how it's possible, but I just think it's weird that I had a dream this morning about a train and now there's like tons of fucking trains going through Hoosick Falls today. You know, and in the dream, I mean, the dream, sometimes I have these dreams that seem like they go on and on, like it seems like elaborate and like it just goes on and on. And it was that kind of dream. Like I dreamt, I dreamt, I think I was in Berkshire County and I don't know. There was a man with a shaved head and he was kind of being nice to me, but then he was kind of being mean to me. And then suddenly there was like all these other people and they seemed like they might've been like vampires or zombies or something. So I was trying to just leave the town, like get away and I must have like abandoned my vehicle in the town just because I was afraid to go back for it. So in the dream, I was trying to get away from the town and then I saw a train and I got on the train and the train took me into like Southern Vermont, which isn't far from here. But then I was like, how am I going to get back to Hoosick Falls? Because I don't have a car. It like didn't occur to me in the dream to like try to get an Uber but, um, yeah, so in the dream, I was, like, trying to figure out what I was going to do, and then it was getting dark out, and I was like, I think I'm going to have to go stay at a motel. And then all the while, in the dream, I was trying to call on my cell phone. I was trying to, like, figure out somebody to call to come pick me up, but I was, like, having trouble using the cell phone. It was like, it was like I would push buttons, and I couldn't. I couldn't seem to make a call. So my point is, it just seems like a weird coincidence that I had a dream about a train this morning. And, um, and I guess I'm also just describing that every now and then, I mean, I always dream excessively, but every now and then there's like one dream and it just seems like it goes on and on and on. And, um, you know, a lot of times I'll have like a series of dreams, but they're different dreams. But anyway, I wish people would just like try to stop, you know, would just stop fucking with my sleep and my dreaming because I don't think I'm psychic. I don't think I had a dream about a train and then all of a sudden there's been like four trains so far today. So yeah, yeah, that's what I wanted to say about that. I don't think I'm going to post this. I don't think I am. Maybe I will. I don't know.